So hello everyone, welcome back to another one of my vlogs. Today I'm going to be going to Pets at Home. I thought I would go ahead and vlog it for you guys because for months and months and months a lot of you have been asking me to do a Pets at Home related vlog. So I need to go there today to get one of my hamsters cremated. Um, I do have a video talking about their cremation service in a bit more detail so I'll have it linked on screen now and I'll also have it linked in the description if you're interested in finding out a little bit more about that. So another reason why I'm going to pets at home is because I want to try and exchange just a uh, tutor. This is the Willow and Lufa Reef. So this is what the tag looks like. It's super cute. It's really, really pretty. Um, I ordered six of them online and two of them arrived broken. Um, so I'm going to see if I can exchange these for something else because they are £5 each and for two of them to break already, I don't really think it's worth the money. So yeah, I hope you all enjoy this vlog. Let me know what you think of it in the comments and I might do something like this again in the future. So this is the bit where they have all the normal hamsters and then this is the adoption center so there's a hamster in there i think most of them are either empty or they're sleeping yeah and then there's some rabbits in the adoption center as well that's so cute cotton candy oh that syrian is so cute Quite big though. Mm -hmm. It's bored. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It. <laughs> Poor hamster. <laughs> oh, there's another one in there as well. Did I usually do that? Oh, yeah, it's bored. These ones are cute. Mm. There's mm -hmm. four in there. Just under the wheel. Yeah, these are the dwarf hamsters, but I think most of them are sleeping. There's a group of robos in there. They're so cute. How well, old is it? That lives up to 20 years. I didn't think like that they were that big. I have them in my college. I've never seen them that big before. Looks like a favourite duster. Mm -hmm. That's a very deadly one. So I've never actually seen some of these treats before. The ones in the sort of lavender packaging. I love the colour, it's so cute. But these are some things that must be new. I like the look of these though. This looks really nice. What is this called? These are called uh, birch slices of parsley. This would look really nice with a natural theme. This looks quite interesting as well. These are called sticks mix, so they're chewable mix of hazel and willow sticks blended with beetroot, apple, parsnip and mint. This is the carrier case that I have. I always get a lot of questions from you guys asking where I got my carrier from. It's from Pets at Home and it is £14. They have some um, Katie clean and cozy in here. I'm not sure how much this bag is. I think it's supposed to be there for three pound or it could be 7.99, I'm not sure, but this is quite expensive and the big bag is 20 pound. These are cute. I've never seen these before, look. Mm, cute. I'm gonna have a look at it, right? Wooden rocket. This must be a new range because I've literally never seen this before. These are cute, but I really, really like this one though. This is adorable. And they've got this and this dangly thing as well. Oh, and they've got this and then this rocket hideaway and a cardboard rocket as well. So here's some of the cages. Obviously these ones are far too small to house a hamster in. Um, here's some more some wheels down here but 
I've never seen this before either. This must be new. Mm, I've seen these online, but I haven't actually seen them in person. They're quite pricey though, six pounds per hat. So there's some more natural looking stuff in this section. So look, they have some of these. This is what I want. And they have some more of these. Because this is what I want to, ex well, this is what I have and I'm going to exchange, see if I can exchange um, six of these for maybe three of these and then about three of these because they're a lot better. They have this one as well, but this is quite big. I love this range, it's so nice and colourful. I have the little one of that. Well, I think I used to, I don't have it anymore. I love this coconut hideaway. I have this in one of my hamster cages. So we're in the dog section now. Can't wait until I actually get a dog because I've never had a dog before. Mm. Probably this one. It tells you. They have like shampoo and stuff. Like dog stuff is so interesting. These are apparently meant to be quite good. Pinch, 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 pinch. Here's some dog leads. These ones are pretty simple ones. I would want a nice pink one. No, I don't really like that one. Yes. Oh, this is the section I like because it's got all the cute stuff and the teddies and stuff. Oh, these are so cute. I love these. Oh, this one is really nice. It's a pig. What about that? Well, that feels really weird. Go <laughs> get that. What is it? Oh, it's a little jumper. There you go. And a little t-shirt. <laughs> I'm new here, that is cute. Oh, I have it's to a do toy it. basket. The bedroom is cute I as well. just love all of these like because toys the and stuff. They'll be perfect. <laughs> they will be perfect. I mean obviously she has fresh water put down twice a day. See when we're out, she wants to drink from the gutter. So this is the dog that I want, West Highland Terrier. So cute. I think this is literally like the perfect dog for me. Okay, we're back from Pets at Home and I ended up replacing the chew toys with this one called Colourful Corn, which it just looks like this. And this other coconut one called Coconut Mobile with banana leaf, which just looks like this is super pretty um so i'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here i know this one was quite short just wanted to bring you guys along with me to pets at home so i'm gonna go ahead and end this video here don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video so bye for now